support right from the onset and they are looking to make amends well the Ghanaians should try to die for their Suleimana the man who plays a tap football in Lyon giving the fans something to cheer about it's something they've been looking forward to he's been the brightest spot in the Ghanaian side they did start against the South Sudan a big ball into the box Aaron SL Aziz the James FC player been very instrumental on the Confederations Cup game it is Kufua Samoa goes round Juma you know, the referee spotting that to be and if Ghana with a chance here to whip this ball into the box I mean tactically see how many yellow and black shirts in the surf yard area trying to make sure that they repel any attacking play there by the Ghanaians it is going to be Aziz whips into the pose and what a save there from that. Apu Magada needed to make the save it was just hidden tip into the top corner there but Magada with that lovely lovely save there he came on to replace Shamlan Kamiya who had a concussion in the match against Congo but Magada simply is showing that he keeps them in the game there another ball whipped in Magada comes out ball still dangling in a very dangerous area Ghana with you they have a chance the Ghanaians have scored very scrappy but I tell you what it's already in Jerry Efriye scores a second for Ghana. Some bit of confusion as to whether the goalkeeper was impeded here. Well, that won't count. That celebration has been cut short there, but the Ghanaians would feel that it should be given. There, he pulls. I'm just talking about the 2021 team. And Dalad Ibrahim for Ghana and the likes of Abdul Fatah Shah, who now plays for Leicester City. And this Ghanaian team with it. You know, the opportunity to find a way out and to rush clears his lines but the Ghanaians will keep possession here comes ACL Suleimana again he's got some trickeries there Suleimana keeps the ball in play looking for another strip pass there is able to find this is a free year and goes right that is some try that is some try I think that the starlets are now getting themselves into the groove again that is a brilliant try from a free at least he had it on target but it was just a feeble one i, I should say but yeah just to show that these players are playing with some confidence and some panache well they have been players who played in the national 17 league in uganda so they know themselves pretty well Ghana are in trouble once again but uh it's been well dealt with if they need at the back very safe Kwame, watch it Aziz, a J gives away to Alan Oriworth. Now he's looking for Usama. And here comes Buyanga. And again, safe throw. Sanya Kubo to deal with it. Yeah, first shot on target. And obviously, it will come from them. I just look at the run from him. Brilliant run from him. But that shot was just feeble to the near post. But that was a brilliant pass into the part of Buyanga. What? Here comes Juma for Kandi. When they have the chance, they try to hit from long range there. Lukwago. Wow, brilliant. Oh, he's trying to sometimes they are able to keep it neat and simple there, but it's been well collected there by Yakubu. Yakubu. Gione. Here comes Usama. What a save. Well, again, this is the man you've been talking about, Kiza Arafat Usama. But it all started from Chione. That wicked left foot of his went through two, three people. You can see there, it just fed him through. What a strike. You know, the KCC player would do Alan Ori Watts. Another ball whipped in again. It's uh, a somewhat clearance. Here comes Suleimana here for Ghana. Up to Suleimana. Charge as well. This man. Certainly would have to find space. Was looking for a free year. Couldn't quite get to him. And look at that confidence. The hippos have been at the back. Was for him against Congo. But too easy there for Saeed Yakubo to deal with it. The Ghanaian goalkeeper. Sends one in. A free year. But this time it is going to be Mensah picking it up. Mensah in the box. Mensah! Well, nobody there for a pass. He goes solo. With the... Into life. 
and he just won himself a free kick. Let's see what Aziz can do with this one. There's Aziz to the far post there, straight to the goalkeeper. And Magada deals with it. That they just came all guns blazing, winning by four goals to two. Yeah. But here they're packed across Sport Stadium. Suleimana swings one to the far post. Again, Magada palms it out there for another corner kick. Yeah. Oh, no. His ball control is being locked there by the fans because he's lighting up the play. Suleimana, yes, a J. A oh, lovely pass now to Kufour. Sends one in, nobody there to pick it up here. And this game so far, by he's made some wonderful runs. He's found the pocket of space, but just that the Ghana defenders have also been proven. But well, Efiye will strike from this range. Magada picks it up here. Not quite some, not some football. Yeah, you saw that little nut like there from Efiye. Just look at that again. Brilliant. But the show was not going to trouble Mac. Good play now, Kakande. Uh, pushed out. Well, you're gonna throw that more. Yeah. Remember, it starts in the first game, and uh, the second game, but has to be uh, put on the bench there. The coach trying to ensure that the captain gets uh, a feel of the ball here, but hasn't really played his part. The crowd line was, remember, Boate coming in. And then, of course, you talk about the as far as these. Once again, Ghana coming up with some flurry of opportunities. Here on ACL, also yeah. a long range of players are beginning to shoot from their long distances. Yeah, we've, so they just couldn't, they just can't penetrate in there. And I think that we should give much more credit to uh, Moses Ochama for doing so. He knows the sort of trader the satellite really possess, and he's doing that expertly. Good play now, Ghana. Efriye giving a chance. Oh, lovely play, Efriye. Efriye! Unlucky. Just unlucky, Efriye. He's, he has this in his locker, doesn't he? Just look at that ball spread through to him again. Lovely control from him. And that's, that strike was, was not too far away at all, Efriye. On his weaker foot, that is some try. I think the goalkeeper had a hand on it. Suleimana will now have to deal with this one. Suleimana has been pushed away by Magada. Ball still in the box. Dangerous for Ghana. And remember Boateng. What a strike. But uh, Juma had to block. Michael Efson. Well, that's strike right there. Boateng ball in the box. Ghana would have opportunities in the night already. Again for the very second time. A three-year denied. Yeah. Yeah, I think there was, there was a little shove and a push in the penalty area and the referee spotted it. Just look at that again. Yeah, I think it's a handball incident that the Ugandans are claiming it. Yeah, and that is the reason why 